India has just taken a giant leap in the semiconductor race. At Semicon India 2025, the country unveiled its first indigenous 32-bit microprocessor chip called Vikram. This was presented to Prime Minister Narendra Modi by Union Minister Ashwini Vaishnav. And it is being hailed as a game changer for India's technology and space ambitions. And here's why Vikram is special. It's designed by ISRO Semiconductor Lab in Chandigarh and it can withstand the extreme conditions of space. Built on a 180 nanometer processor, this chip has already been tested on board the PSLV C60 mission. In simple words, it is tough, reliable and built for launch vehicles, satellites and deep space exploration. This new processor called Vikram 3201 is the successor to ISRO's earlier chip, Vikram 1601, which has powered Indian missions since 2009. The upgrade means faster processing, support for high-level languages like ADA, floating-point computations and all the critical software tools built in-house by ISRO scientists. Even a C compiler is in the works. But India's semiconductor story doesn't stop at ISRO. In Sanand, Gujarat, semiconductor company CG Semi is all set to roll out the very first Made in India commercial chip from its OSAT pilot facility. This was made possible after the Modi government approved the country's first semiconductor unit there back in 2023. And through the design-linked incentive scheme, as many as 23 chip design projects have been sanctioned to support startups and innovators. Companies like Verve Semi Microelectronics are building advanced chips for defence, aerospace, electric vehicles and energy systems. It is a strong signal that India is no longer just a consumer of chips, but also a creator. And here's why this is crucial. For decades, India depended on foreign suppliers for critical chips. Now, with Vikram, we have a homegrown solution for one of the most high-tech, sensitive sectors – space technology. The Prime Minister summed it up at Semicon India 2025. Design in India, trusted by the world. So, India's semiconductor journey just hit a major milestone. What do you think? Can India emerge as a true semiconductor hub in the coming decade? Tell us your thoughts in the comments below. Until next time, this is Richa Devedi signing off.